Summer has well and truly arrived. We're here this week to tell you exactly how to look after your dogs in the heat. Tip number one, never ever ever leave your dog in an unattended car in the heat. Temperatures can climb so quickly in parked cars and even with the windows down or the fan on, your dog could very easily overheat and become dehydrated. Tip number two, Avoid walking on any hot surfaces. Pavements can get really, really hot and can actually burn your dog's paws. Tip number three, always make sure that you're providing lots of fresh and clean water. Tip number four is to always make sure that you've got fresh water with you on your on the go. When you take your dog for a walk, make sure that you're taking a portable bowl and a water bottle so that you can keep your dog hydrated. Tip number five, if you're deciding to go out on a really hot day, then it's always better to leave your dog at home. He's gonna get really easily dehydrated in hot situations, so it's actually kinder to your dog to make sure that he stays at home if it's really, really hot outside. Tip number six, make sure you're not over-exercising your dog in the heat. Your dog doesn't usually know his limits, so you need to decide them for him. If it's really hot outside and your dog starts to pant a lot, or if he's becoming a bit lethargic when he's going to fetch the ball, then nine times out of 10, this is gonna be because he's too hot to actually exercise. Tip number seven is to get your dog a cooling vest or a cooling mat. These are filled with gel and they're gonna bring out the heat from the body of your dog and allow him to cool down a lot easier. Tip number eight is to buy a good doggy sun cream. Now it sounds ridiculous because they're covered in fur, but your dog's skin can become damaged due to UV. So it's really important to make sure that he is protected just like you would protect your own skin in the sun. Tip number nine is to allow your dog to stand in a cool pool, a paddling pool, something like that, or to freeze a towel and allow him to stand on that. Your dog actually lets out most of his heat through his paws, so it's usually through the paws and from his panting that he's gonna be able to cool his body down. So if you can uh, speed up the process by allowing his feet to get a little bit cold, uh, cold water, um, this is gonna speed up the process of him bringing down his body temperature. Now, tip number 10 is to make sure that you're walking your dog at the coolest times of the day. So first thing in the morning and in the evening are gonna be the coolest times of the day. Now, you may remember from last week's video that we had a special competition on to win a doggy bone chew toy. And we're really pleased to announce that the winner of, of this competition is Sarah. So congratulations, please do send over your address to relaxmydogmusic at gmail.com and we'll get your chew toy sent to you as soon as possible. Now, you may have noticed that I'm wearing a special Relax My Dog t-shirt today. And if you would like to win one of these, all you need to do is comment your best doggy life hack or top tip in the comment section below and we're going to be sending one lucky viewer out a special Relax My Dog exclusive t-shirt. Now we really hope that you enjoyed today's video. If you did, please do give us a big thumbs up and if you haven't subscribed already, then make sure that you hit that button. But that's it from us for now, so we'll see you again next week. Bye!